<laughs> good morning, you guys. Good morning. <sighs> Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. Hey. Ho. Hey. Ho. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, you guys. October 24th uh, is not 7.42 a.m. I'm just coming to you guys. <coughs> I get up at 7 and lay right back down. <coughs> I lay right back down for a little bit. <coughs> I was up most of the night oh, because oh goodness I just switched glasses I was up most of the night because my legs started cramping up on me my feet so I went ahead and ran me a nice hot tub of water and I sat in the tub and I watched uh, that new troll movie. Trolls Band Together, I think it's called. I forget 100% <coughs> the name of it. But it was good. I just brushed my teeth, washed my face. Um, I didn't put any cream on my face yet. I, I feel like I should, but I just don't feel like it. <laughs> So we'll see how far we get without it. Ah, 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 ah. The booty over there. He's trying to. As always, I don't know why he's so infatuated with trying to come in here in this office and get under this desk. Ain't nothing under there. Yep, that's missing. Ah, it's time to. Redo, but I don't want to. So I'm just gonna put a rubber band on the end, keep it from unraveling. Got bars, y'all. Got bars. <laughs> um, anyway, how are you guys doing this beautiful morning? It's a little darkish, you know, gloomyish, but it's still a beautiful morning nonetheless. The Lord woke us up, blessed us, and allowed us to live to see another beautiful day. So let's rejoice and be glad in it, right? Let's see. That's Chapo. Opening my doors, coming and going as he please. <laughs> let's see. Go ahead and log in right quick. So like yesterday, I did uh, study, like I said I was, I didn't do it at the time that I said I was going to do, but I definitely did, I studied, um, I read more of Genesis, um, it was more um, about who begat who and you know who was the son of this one, but it's amazing how long they live, wow, I know I said that the last time, but it's just amazing to me how long, you know, and I think as I was reading yesterday, I felt like the reason that they were um, allowed to live as long as they did uh, was to, to multiply, be fruitful and multiply. I, I truly believe that. Like, <laughs> I truly believe that. Um... I truly believe that. Also, what was I going to say, y'all? I lost my train of thought. Dang. Be fruitful and multiply. Oh, I forget what it was, y'all. I forget. Oh, 
it's good. It's good. I probably could use a little more. No, no, no. Sugar, but no. It's hot. My book up. <laughs> um, so yeah, guys. I'm hoping today goes by quickly. Um, I'm going to cook. The pork loin today, or maybe even tomorrow. I took it out early this morning. It's in the refrigerator. Um, I cooked the chicken yesterday, so we'll eat that today. Finish that today. Um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll do the pork loin later this evening when I get off work. Maybe I'll do that. Or even maybe my last break of the day, I'll put it on. I'm not sure yet. I'm, I'm thinking about it. <laughs> um, just getting this logged in here, you guys, because I'm a little... When it's time to go, it's time to go. I'm on a mission today. Yesterday, as I was in Rome, I noticed I was doing making mistakes, but some stuff that was happening, it, it, I don't think it was me because I'm like, I couldn't understand why. Oh, anyway, <laughs> I'm just on a ball. I'm really trying to um, get so many done because they expect or they would like for you to do um, at least 20 enrollments per hour right and so I'm constantly counting counting so if I start at 8 from 8 30 to 9 30 by 9 30 I should have 20 or more enrolls I am not reaching that goal y'all like with and, and trying to do that without making any mistakes you know what I'm saying so it's not so much the speed if you're making mistakes you know what I'm saying so um, and I don't know if I am or not I just know that there's some things like I have to pay more attention to like I'll notice that there's something that need to be done and forget if I did it or not it'll be two referrals later I go oh wait a minute <laughs> you know and that's not good so for me anyway I don't, I don't you know I try to really, really do a great job give my all I want to be an asset you know what I'm saying not a liability <laughs> if that makes sense any weird dreams yesterday I don't think I don't know that sounds weird me saying I don't think but sometimes my mind just be going I can't tell if it's dreaming or not I really can't I know a lot of people seem to think deja vu um, is, is, is because you've lived or you've been here before or you've done something before um, I, I personally think that deja vu it could have been a dream that you had or that I had and it could have been so felt so real you know what I'm saying I don't necessarily think um, that is that you know oh you've lived here before you're remembering a past life or something I don't feel that at all um, at all there's nothing in the word that says that that's a possibility I just think that you know our minds are very active you know and 
sometimes you, you you're doing things so much and so often that you know it's inevitable to think about it. You know, it, it seems like deja vu because you've done it before. You have. You're, it's like every day I get up and do the same thing. Every day. So if I go to sleep and dream that I got up and I'm doing the same thing, that's not deja vu. You know what I'm saying? That's actually what I do every day. I, if that makes sense. I just don't feel like we had a past life. I don't think or feel that at all. There's nothing in the word that says that nothing and I have to go by the word of God you know what I'm saying if I'm mistaken please call me out please point out the path the scripture the verses I would love to know I, I would stand corrected I haven't read it or seen it nowhere you know but I don't argue or debate with anybody about how or what they feel you know, they are entitled to feel however and whatever they feel. And I understand that, you know, we are all, have our own ideas and opinions about things. You know, it's what makes us unique. That's what set us aside, you know. One of what makes us unique and set us aside. Sorry guys, <laughs> y'all know I'm always trying to do two or three things at one time. <sighs> always trying to do, always trying to do two or three things at one time. I'm not sure if I did that. Squad this. Then I exit out, then I <laughs> sorry guys. Try to get it together. They had I saw um a message pop up yesterday. Uh that VTO was available. I turned away immediately. <laughs> like, no, I don't need to leave. I would love to be able to, but I can't afford to. This coffee's so warm, it feels so good. Oh, I have a slight chill, it's because I have the window up. <clears throat> So yeah, slight chill, but it's all right. <laughs> Takes me a minute to log in. Y'all, so many different applications that need to be pulled up. What did you guys have for dinner yesterday? Let me know. Comment down below and let me know what you had for dinner yesterday. And was it good? <laughs> was it good? I know sometimes with me, it's, it's it can be a hit or miss. 
it could be a hit or miss depending on how I feel, what I'm doing, you know, it could be a hit or miss. Like when I got off yesterday, I was really tired. Um, mentally, I was tired, y'all. Like, man, <coughs> I um, I fix myself something to eat. I don't even remember. Uh, I do know that I had a uh, glass of wine, and then um, I sat. I had the TV on, but I don't think I really watched anything. And then I just went ahead and turned it off and got in my word. Started reading. I think I left off at chapter 9. Either chapter 9 or chapter 10. I forget which one. So I think it a lot in. Yeah. And I plan on doing, uh, reading some more today. Um, but I also want to um, pray more. I did pray a little bit, um, but I really want to pray more. Work on my communication with God. One thing, as I was reading yesterday, you know, uh, and I said it before, but you know, it's just amazing how much God communicated and with His people back there. How much He was around and involved, uh, and it wasn't physically, but spiritually. Okay, spirit, spiritually, spiritually. He was around. He communicated. He talked. I mean, everything. He was available. You know? And that's crazy because in spite of all of that, in spite of all of that, men still did whatever the heck they wanted to do. You know what I'm saying? And God is just so understanding, so forgiving. You know, oh, I did find out, you guys. I did now that I think about it. I did ask my dad, right, about being fruitful and multiplying. Okay, because I told y'all that really in my brain was like, well, how do you be fruitful and multiply when he's only, he only created two people in the beginning? So that would mean incest, right? Up, oh, I hear you. That would mean incest. And he was like, "Yeah, that's exactly what it was back then. Back then, it was allowed um, because how else were you going to multiply? <laughs> you know." So I totally get that. I totally get it now. I understand. You know, but it just seems I don't know. It seems weird. And I know today's time and ages, things are so different. Um, compared to back then, obviously, so different. But I never would have guessed that, you know. But I, I couldn't help but wonder. Like it just stood out to me. How are they being fruitful and multiplying? Alright, I'm coming. I'm coming. My app is reminding me. Okay. It's loading up for me. I accidentally clicked out. <laughs> Okay, for today, uh, October 21st, Tuesday, it is now 8.02 a.m. And it says, start your day with James chapter 1, verse 5. Okay, 
Uh, let's go ahead and here's today's verse. If any of you lack wisdom, let him ask God, who gives generously to all without reproach, and it will be given him. Tap on the words that stand out to you. Wisdom. Actually, lacks wisdom. Ask God. Right? Anything that comes to mind. God is willing to help us. All we need to do is ask. Just ask. And believe. We have to ask and we have to believe. We have to trust. End in prayer and reflection. If any of you lacks wisdom, let him ask God who gives generously to all without reproach and it will be given him. God will help. Just ask and believe. Amen. Right. Oh my nose. I'm really not happy. Um I'm finding out about Timu. They're saying that people are finding that order from Timu are finding out that their information is being sold and you know, the credit card information and things like that. That really sucks, you know, because I really wanted to one day <laughs> try team and order some stuff I really did but man that's not cool at all I always say my credit is, is not the best all they gonna do is get mad with my credit if anything you take my credit and make it better then we good <laughs> run away <laughs> but yeah no, that sucks you know that really sucks if they do things like that. That's not cool at all. Especially, you know, you have good products or whatever and people are interested in. Don't mess it up doing dumb stuff. Don't mess it up. Why would you want to? Why would you want to? Ah, ah. No. <laughs> you come and try to go right up under my desk. No. We got doing that cat. <laughs> no kitty. No. What's your destructive self? Okay. Prayers and promises for depression and anxiety. Ooh, it's hot. I got the window open and it's hot. I had to get up this morning on the couch. I got so hot, I turned the fan on, and I was on the couch, upside down. I had my foot on the wall, just upside down, hanging there. It was comfortable. And then here comes Chapo. He jumps on the couch, and he comes and steps on my chest and sits there and looks at me. <laughs> I'm laying there with my feet up in the air, and my back, hang, my head hanging off the couch. And he comes and he sits on me. I'm like, dude, really? <laughs> He's like, you getting up now? <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right. So today is going to be thankfulness. See that? I have not stopped giving thanks for you. Remembering you in my prayers. Giving thanks is a sacrifice that truly honors me. If you keep to my path, I will reveal to you the salvation of God. Rejoice always. Pray continually. Give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. Give thanks as you enter the gates of of his temple. Give praise as you enter his courtyard. Give thanks to him and praise his name. Psalms 100 
and for. God, my Father, thank you for your loving kindness towards me. Thank you for the gift of family and friends. Thank you that you have been at. Thank you that you have been faithful all my life. When I am struggling to see any good, all it takes is stepping back and finding the small true things to see those glimpses of grace. I will practice gratitude until it is as natural as breathing. Thank you for this very moment I am in. Thank you for perspective. Thank you for the warmth of the sunshine. Thank you. What can you thank God for right now? Wow. What can I not thank him for? Like, everything. What can you thank him for right now? Everything. Everything. But most important for me, I thank him for his grace and mercy. I thank him for his grace and mercy. Right now to be, if I was to pick, choose his grace and mercy. That's what I thank him for right now. <laughs> It is that graceful dispensation that we are in right now that has that that comforts me in the fact that I know that I'm not going to hell. I've always, always said I don't ever want to go to hell. You know, I don't want to go to hell. There's no turning back. There's no second chance from that. It is what it is. When we leave here, that's it. As far as this this earth, this body, this flesh, right? That's it. People think, oh, we're going to be reincarnated. Oh, you're going to come back again. And oh, this, oh, that. No, it's over. It's over. We will live forever. Eternity with our Heavenly Father in the spiritual sense not flesh the Lord uh, sorry Lord it's me again I don't even know why I started off the Lord um, today is the 24th walk steady walk steady walk steady all right, let's see if I can see. Direct my footsteps according to your word. Let no sin rule over me. Psalms 9, 119, uh, verse 133. What is it about high heels? <laughs> Every family album contains a photo of an adorable toddler attempting to walk in those shoes. And every woman remembers her wobbly attempt to appear graceful in that first pair of pumps. You know that is so true. That is so true. I think, I don't know if I did it, but I know my kids did it. They walked, they tried to wear, you know, my shoes, especially Jeremiah. And uh, he would try to wear mine, he would wear granddad's, you know. They all did it, did Kiana's, um... Cadence and Alex did it. Cadence had on her heels or something one time with some stiff socks. <laughs> oh my god, and Alex has done it before, yeah. I remember Lavelle's um, middle child when she was here, she did it, she would put on his shoes. Wow, well, every and that's so true. Most of us also have a memory of a not so graceful stumble or even a twisted ankle. Yet, somehow, the stilettos retain its appeal. Who hasn't relied on the steady arm of an escort or companion in far more sensible footwear? Walking with Jesus, oh that's a good example. <laughs> walking with Jesus is a little like learning to walk in four inch heels. Others may, others make it look so easy, gliding along apparently sinless, while we feel shaky and uncertain, prone to stumble at any moment. Will we take a wrong step, fall flat on our faces? 
Okay, fall flat on our faces. Um, do anyone else feel hurt? Oh, do do anyone else's feet hurt? Ah ah ah. No. Lean on the arm, the strong arm of the Savior. Allow Him to steady you and direct your steps. That is beautiful. That was a very good uh, comparison. That that was beautiful. Lean on the strong arm of the Savior. Allow Him to steady your steps. Yes. And you know what? We gonna fall, right? But just like with shoes, you still get right on back up and try it again. Just like when you skating or you riding a bike or learning to ride a bike, you fall, you get up and you keep going. You get up and you keep going. You try not to do the same thing you did that caused you to fall, for one. Okay? Lord, I know I'm not confident in all areas of my walk with you. And that's true, I'm not. I ask for your guidance and steady hand. Lead me in all that I venture out to do. I trust you. And I do. I do. I trust him. Yes, I do. I trust him. I say it all the time. I trust God. I'm the one I don't trust. <laughs> you know? But God, oh, for sure. For sure. And one more, y'all, before I get ready to start here. Y'all know we have to do Psalms 23. Psalms 23. Oh, no. Psalms 23. Y'all got so many placeholders. <laughs> I really do in this book. Okay. In this word. Psalms 23, you guys. Alright. Let's take a moment. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valleys of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil. My cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Y'all, this is so true. The Lord is my shepherd and I shall not want. Because God is my shepherd, um, I have a little peace right now. You know, knowing that he's going to protect me. He's going to guide me. He's going to keep me. Even in my own mistakes. Right? Even as I stumble and fall. Even as I try to figure out my way. You know, even as I... Um, struggle at times to get closer, you know, but I am trying, I am moving, um, I am trying to move forward as opposed to just um, standing there and waiting for God to come to me. I need to go to God, right, because he's always been there with me. He's waiting on me, as I've said it many times. Um, something that stood out to me today um, was yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadows of death. Now, for me, that, that verse the valleys of the shadow of death <laughs> to me that's life right as I navigate through life right I'm walking through the valleys of the shadow of death I get up every morning I do the same things I go to and from the donate I go to and from church um, to and from the, the store or here or there God is keeping me He's protecting me He's guiding me He's with me the whole time You know as I'm sitting in the car And I'm driving He's there right along with me He's protecting me And at times He, ta he takes control of that wheel You know what I'm saying um, God is amazing Like He's right there with me so I, I need not fear. He's going to protect me. He's going to comfort me. Right? Thou preparest a table before me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Now, I believe that for me, God prepared the table for me. I don't go without. 
You know, I'm not hungry. I'm not missing a meal. I haven't missed a meal. God is good, right? He's always made a way. Now, the part where it says in the presence of my enemies, um, for me, for that, my enemies mean the devil. You know, the demons, the devil, those spirits that want me to fail, that want me to go without, that want me to struggle, that want me to be depressed, that want me to be scared. You know, I don't have to be. Now, again, I'm not perfect, and I will at times get a little anxious um but god is so good god is so amazing and i am learning more and more to rest in that peace y'all it's a beautiful thing when you can rest in peace when you can know and feel like god's got me god's got it you know whatever you need he will provide Da, 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 da. I forget the words. Whatever you want, God's got it. God's got it. Whatever you, He will provide. I can't remember the words. Da, 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 da. But God's got it. <laughs> He's got it. We just need to ask. We need to ask, believe. We need to seek, right? <coughs> if you don't seek knowledge, if you don't study, Seeking is studying. I'm studying so that I can learn, right? If we don't do that, how will you know? Unless you're just blessed to um, to know, you know, but usually you have to study, you know, and I never was good um, at studying. I never was good at tests. I, I sucked, you know, um, but when it comes down to the Word of God, my life depends on it, basically. My life depends on it. Just I don't want to go to hell. <laughs> That's not where I'm going. Do not save a seat for me. Mm -mm. No. Do not. Now when it comes down to heaven. Save a seat for me. If you make it in glory. For I do. Save. Save a seat for me. Save me a seat. I don't even have to be in the front. <laughs> I just want to be among God's people. I want to be among the angels. You know what I'm saying? I, I just want to be among. I want to be a part of. <laughs> you know, God's. I want to be in His presence. You know, so many people say, "Oh, I died and I saw this light. Oh, I died and I went to hell and God brought me back." And da, 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 da. I don't know what their experiences are. Those are their experiences. You know, but. <laughs> Chop up, George. What, what are you doing, huh? You you looking to get in my chair? Look, he like you still in that chair? Help a guy pass me. You see that? Chop up, chop. You pushing it, buddy? You pushing it? Let's see. Oh. I gotta turn the light off. Ah. <laughs> I still haven't submitted a picture yet. I'm gonna have to do that this morning. Say good morning, people. Say good morning. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. Say hello. 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 She put me on this camera again. Why do you keep doing this to me? <laughs> I just want to lay down. You're not going to let me lay down, are you? No? <laughs> I swear, I hear Russian. <laughs> oh, okay, Chapo, I'm going to pull you down, dude. I'm going to pull you down. I'm going to pull you down. Yeah. Okay, guys, have a great day today. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Good. Say bye. Bye. First break of the day. <sighs> Trying to work with the cat constantly jumping in my arms. Like he's so rotten. He's so rotten. He's just a rotten thing. Okay, I'm gonna 
quickly wash the dishes. Some this morning okay. and from overnight. down to, to eating the food. It is literally everywhere. Alright guys, I'm gonna okay. oh. Man, my freeze my refrigerator gets super crazy cold. Jeez. How are you guys doing this morning? I'm trying to hurry. My break is not long. And I want to... Get these dishes. Make sure to get... Vegetables. Okay, pick that up. Go ahead and back. I don't know about you, but whenever I make chicken, baked chicken, I always have to have like it's always good for me to have. Um A piece of bread and cheese with it for some reason. <laughs> I don't know. Just maybe it's like having chicken in the soup. I don't know. But anyway, how are you guys? Day going, man. It's going. It's busy. They offered VTO. I went to it. <laughs> and I didn't accept it. I didn't. You know, like I said, it's time to get on the ball. Different thing if today was, you know, a day I, I had to go me, then I would probably consider leaving a little early. But for the most part, I'm not even going to do that. I'm just going to, it's not nothing serious that needs to be taken care of or urgent. There's no reason I need to take off. I don't feel bad. I feel fine. So, you know, like I'm secretly thin. You know, I'm tired of my chest being short. I've got to get on the ball. Nobody fought for that. But it'd be so tempting, y'all. <laughs> Man, talk about temptation. Jeez. Well, yeah, I'm enrolling. Hopefully, you're right yesterday. I'll be doing that all day. Oh, I do have a, a development course I had set up and I forgot about it. But it's today at 2. Those usually last about an hour. So I'll be doing that today at 2. And then hopefully afterwards, go back to the going. Until it's time to go. So. I'm hoping next time my schedule will go and then it won't get too busy when they need me to get on the phone. But if I have to, I will not be here. Uh -oh. 
but I'm trying to move, I'm trying not to, you know, I don't want to make no mistakes or anything like that, but I'm trying to get as many done as I can. And then if I come across her, that makes you have to sit for me and search stuff, you know, that's what we do now. But other than that, pretty good so far, pretty good that. Um, so I decided that I'm going to cook, I'll put that food on, on my last break of the day. That way, you be cooking, right? And then you either I will be done when I get off or almost done. And that way I can just, you know, I'll get my study on while the food's cooking. I can study. Right. I won't have to worry about washing the dishes. Because I just did that. From the you know, dishes from today or from yesterday. Just here. Make a little bit later, you guys. And sweep, sweep, and mop. And I may get this uh, stove wiped out. I think I'll do the stove on the weekend because I want to get Brillo pad, get my stove right. Yeah, and that's it. Okay, get my water. Oh, piece of bread and cheese. Let's see. Look <laughs> yeah, I'm in there trying to work and chop on just climbing up my legs, like pick me up type of thing, all up on me. So while I'm working, he's sitting up here sliding down, but he keeps, you know, it's so funny because he'll slide, feel his stuff slide down and he'll climb back up. <laughs> hey, buddy, he ain't talking about you. You heard your name, didn't you? Huh? Since you're talking about me. Talking about me? Yup, I am talking all about you. Okay, got my water, got my food, turn the light off, and head on back in. Excuse me, cat. Excuse me. All right. Ooh, so chilly. May have to. Put my heater on on my seat. It's not cold enough to turn the heat on on, but it's just chilly. Okay, guys, I'm back now. I'm gonna go ahead and get ready to start by working. I hope you guys' morning is going well, and I will talk to you later in the day. Bye now.
got a whole bed. You can't go lay in your bed so I can work. sit in your own seat hmm? on your bed can you go and lay on your bed would you please so I can work hmm? I really need you to do that what you think no no let's do it anyway okay Ugh.
Hey guys, good evening. It's m Tuesday, uh, <laughs> October 24th, 8.29 p.m. Um, I, I'm tired. <laughs> and I said 8.29, it's 5.29, I'm sorry. Um, I'm just sitting here. I got off work at 5. Swept the kitchen floor. I did not mop it yet, but I did sweep. And I put dinner on. I was going to put it in the oven, but I decided to leave it on top of the stove and let it cook slow that way. Uh, I just didn't feel like the heat from the oven. And, um, I mean, it gets hot as it is just being on the stove. And while that's cooking, I'm going to sit here and read. I told y'all I stopped yesterday at Genesis chapter 9. I was incorrect. It's Genesis chapter 19, verse 15. That's where I left off at. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up from there, you guys, and I'll get some reading in. Um, and I'll talk to you later. If not later today, most definitely on tomorrow, be the Lord's will. I hope you guys had an amazing Tuesday. Um, be it terrific, taco, thankful. Whatever Tuesday it was for you, I hope you enjoyed the day. For those of you whose day is just starting, um, I hope that your, you know, the rest of your day goes, you know, equally as well. And uh, you guys just remember to say your prayers for all our brothers and sisters in Christ, not just our family, friends, and loved ones. Remember to treat people the way the Lord would, okay, with grace, dignity, respect, you know, with love, kindness, and patience, okay. And expect great things. I'm expecting great things, you guys, as always, to happen through me, for me, and to me on today, even this evening. All right? Uh, so, I will talk to you guys, like I said, a little bit later. Um, yeah, I was going to read a bit to you guys, but I'm just so, I don't know, tired. I just said a little prayer. Ask the Lord to help me to um, give me the patience and um, help me to understand what I read. Give me what to read and help me to apply um, His Word in my life. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started. You guys enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, later. Bye now.